Daniel, we're uh, not too far away now from the, the first leg of the, the Conference League tie against uh, St. Joseph. What's the, the mood like in the camp? Um, yeah, really good. Um, training, you know, training's been quite good, quite tough. Um, sort of a lot of double sessions and um, obviously just working on sort of shape and, and the, the shape of the team. So, um, no, we've been, we've been working hard and, uh, yeah, really looking forward to, to getting over there and, and, and getting the first leg uh, out of the way. Yeah, lots of the kind of attention and the work, I suppose, has been building up towards uh, this game. So is it is it good to get that competitive game you know, coming up, you knowing the friendlies are sort of behind you and this is what you've been focused on and, and ready to play? Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, we've obviously, that was our, our, our third and last last sort of pre-season friendly now and um, we've been working on sort of a bit of a different system and, and um, you know, tinkering with a few things and, and uh, positionally and stuff. So um, you know we've done a lot of a lot of work um, since the the Hamilton game, and you know we're just looking to build on that now. Obviously um, for the next few days leading up to the, the game in Gibraltar. Do you feel a lot of progress has been made in a relatively short space of time? That the TNS game was was an encouragement, more obviously in terms of performance and, and result. Yeah, definitely. You know I think um, looking obviously looking back to the to the Hamilton game, you know we were sort of. Um, went through a bit of shape the, the night before the game and it was sort of 15, 20 minutes and then we were sort of straight into it. You know, boys obviously having to, to adjust and, and adapt to different sort of styles and uh, formations and, and positions and whatever else. But, um, you know, look, it's, it's, going, it's probably going to take a wee bit of time. Um, a few new faces, obviously, and, you know, some of the boys that obviously from here uh, last year and, um, you know, just, yeah, it's just going to be about working on it and, and try and get it right, and and you know hopefully we'll we'll be able to do that in the next couple of training sessions. You know leading up to the game. Uh, obviously, we we go to St Joseph's in the, in the first leg. You know it's hard to know maybe exactly what they expect from a team that we haven't played before, and and style of play and and all that sort of thing. But is it a, a matter of trying to kind of adjust while you're there, trying to play our own game and and, and see maybe where that takes us? Um, yeah, you know, obviously we don't we don't know too much about them. Um, <clears throat> I don't know why the the management staff have, have seen sort of games or clips or videos or whatever. But um, I think the main thing is, is is just probably focusing on ourselves and you know working working towards what we are good at and and you know sort of cementing our style of play and um, the way we want to you know try and play and, and, and go on in the game. So. Um, I think it's important, obviously, to, to not worry so much about that position, but to, to sort of um, have a look at them and see what way they set up. But I think you know we'll be we'll be focusing on ourselves going into the game. And on a personal note, you've been kind of playing off Lee Bonus, maybe in a, a couple of different positions in, in pre-season. Is is that type of rapport and relationship start starting to, to build with the likes of him and others as well? Yeah, I think so. Um, like I said, it will probably. You know, take a wee a wee bit of time. Obviously, getting as towards you know getting towards the the start of the season. Um, but listen, that's all all going to happen out in the training pitch and and the the video sessions and and the team meetings and stuff. So yeah, it's just about trying to obviously build that relationship, not just with Lee, but with you know with other boys within the squad. And um, yeah, no, I'm, I'm really looking, really looking forward to it and, and excited. Yeah, and Tiernan often talks about you know having to enjoy what we do. Obviously, the the European games coming up is, is something that you know is there to, to be enjoyed work, worked all season um, to, to get there so it's yeah something to be enjoyed and something to be relished and something to be to be tackled head on yeah no it's massive I think you know after today you know it was, it was a good workout you know against a, a decent side so now we're just f fully focused on on this game next week and I think uh, we're sort of getting that wee bit wee buzz around the dressing room and, and the training sessions and you know we're all we're all really looking forward to it and uh, just finally going away on, on Sunday, just getting that wee extra day to maybe prepare, acclimatise, that, that type of thing. But that helps being around each other and, and you know, a new kind of squad coming together as well helps off the pitch as, as well as on the pitch. Yeah, of course, yeah. It's it's it's, uh, it's a big factor of it, you know, within within obviously the dressing room. Like I said, a, a lot of new faces and, um, you know, getting that sort of team bonding, if you like, it's 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 going to be important, not just for these games, but for, for the upcoming season as well. Brilliant, thank you. Yeah.